What's up guys, wanted to make a quick video here. Um, just to kind of touch over the last couple of days. I know this week has been a really, really slow week. It's been, the Bears have been killing this week. So I think, what, we only had, what, one day that was slightly green towards the end yesterday. Even today ended off in the red, but obviously, you know, some of us that are still in the chat ended up green with those, those plays that caught out. Uh, I mean, I banked on the uh, CDXC. Uh, which was the only trade I took all day. Everything else was just sitting there watching. I mean, it doesn't help that this GameStop thing <laughs> is still going on with Wall Street bets and everything like that. All the attention has been diverted. Um, but, yeah, so pretty much just wanted to make this quick video uh, for you guys that, you know, that are new and whatnot. You got to understand that sometimes you got to just sit on your hands. Every day is not going to be a trading day, um, and that's okay. You know, don't try to force trades that aren't there. Even with the one trade I was successful on, I left a lot of money on the table. But at the time, you know, it didn't fit my strategy. So, you know, I'm not too mad about that. I banked on it. So I can't can't be mad um, and did exactly what I wanted to do. There's always going to be those times where you miss, you know, a lot more of a run up than you thought it would be. So understand that you don't need to trade every moment of the day. Um, you know, it's OK to sit in your hands and watch. Cash is still a position, you know, um, or even sometimes when it's red. You know, some people trade both ways. I do every now and then. Sometimes when it's red, you know, learn to be a, a versatile trader. It's nothing wrong with that either. Um, but also, most importantly, you know, sitting on your hands is just fine. Um, so I just want to kind of get that out there. I know a lot of people were trying to jump into alerts that weren't going. I'm like, you know, why? There's no setup there, you know. Um, especially in markets. When the market is red, you, you definitely don't want to be trying to fight against the market. Um, that's, that's like almost point blank trading one one you know, if it's there, it'll be there. If it's not, it's not. So don't try to force trades that aren't there. Um, and definitely don't try to go against the trend and trade against the market. Wait for these setups to show that fits your trading style and, you know, execute. But other than that, um, you know, tomorrow's Friday, hopefully, you know, it's a green day, but it's Friday. So <laughs> the odds of that are happening, you know, slim to none, probably. On top of it being a bear week. But, um, yeah, I mean, in the meantime, too, you know, you could be studying, you know, especially for a lot of you new guys who probably don't even know what some basic terminologies are. Um, I encourage you to do that as well, too. Every day is not going to be a trading day. So, um, you know, keep your head up. You know, there'll be more days. Uh, you know, there are plays there. So you just got to know to find them that fit your trading style. But, again, don't force them if they're not there. Other than that, you know, let's just shoot for tomorrow. Hopefully we have a green day. All right, I'll talk to you guys later.